Good morning. Today we're going to look at the distributive properties. So when we talk about multiplication, it can show, be shown in different ways. So we talked about how multiplication, you can put the symbol, and we know that means to multiply. We also talked about how you can put a dot, and that also means to multiply. But sometimes we can have um, also a bracket. So we sometimes go four times five. And if inside that bracket we have an algebraic expression, we can go like this, four times five x plus one. Or let's just change it to n just so that it doesn't get confused with multiplication. So 5n plus 1. So what we would have to do is we'd have to multiply the 4 by the 5. So that's going to give us 20. But we can't forget the n. So that's 20n. And then we're going to multiply the 4 by the 1. And that's 4 times 1 is 4. So we put it like this. So our expression is 20n plus 4. If I had something like with the subtraction, it would be the same thing. I can have 3n minus 2. So I go 3 times 3 is 9. That's 9n. And then 3 times 2 is 6. But this time i got to remember to put the subtraction in between. Sometimes we can even have an integer. So I can go negative 2 times 3n plus 4. So I can go negative 2 times 3 is negative 6, because a negative and a positive is negative. And then negative 2 times positive 4 is going to give me um, negative 8, so minus 8, because minus 8 is the same as negative 8. So negative 6n minus 8, which would be the same thing as if I had negative 6n plus negative 8. It's just that this is clean, this is sort of gets messy, because then we got brackets here and everything. So we always sort of pretend that we're multiplying a negative times that Addition is, so we're making it a negative times a, a positive. So it becomes negative 8. I can do another one for you. So negative 4. Let's do it this time with a subtraction. So 2n minus 2. So it's going to be negative 4 times a positive 2 is negative 8n. Negative 4 times negative 2. Let's do times negative 2. Negative 4 times negative 2 is positive 8. So we now have a plus 8. 